Room emptied by crooks who have hit a senior facility again and again, robbing them of thousands of dollars in items and their sense of security. They came in on uh, Monday, everything was gone. The area rug, the couch, the coffee table, the side tables, the chairs. But now residents at the senior facility on Elm Street are learning how much many others care. Nine on your side's Tony Moronis explains. Residents at Elm Street Senior Living aren't feeling so comfortable. You know, I'm looking in the hallway stairs, I'm checking the bathroom. You know. Wendell Russell is just a little on edge because he's standing in a room where he and other residents would normally gather to socialize. But this weekend, somebody stole all their furniture. When it happened and I came, that, this was a very elegant place and it still is. But to have people or persons come in here and take stuff out of here, you know, without the supervisory uh, authority, that means they robbing me of my comfort and my safety. The 15 unit building is secured, but there are no cameras and no alarm system. The managers let everyone know what happened via Facebook and what happened next shocked administrators. Opposite side of the story is that the response from the community has been so positive. So while we were initially very discouraged, our hearts have been lifted because people are offering to donate furniture, money, um, the security system that we might need, people have offered to pay for that. Algin's Furniture on Main Street will supply them with whatever they need. It's the company's way of giving back. I think I kind of made them happy. <laughs> um, I think, you know, they were looking for, you know, uh, someone to kind of step up to the plate, and I felt like, uh, you know, our company could do that. But still, the break-in rattled some seniors' nerves just a bit. Russell has one request from all crooks. If, if you don't hear anything else I see, please allow this place to be off limit. Tony Moronis, night on your side, over the Rhine. And the residents will meet with police tomorrow to learn more about what happened and what precautions they can take to protect themselves. If you know anything about the theft, call Crime Stoppers at 513-352-3040.